All right, with the marine forecast, gale warnings in effect for all locations through tomorrow morning. Still going to be breezy in the afternoon tomorrow, but the winds should back off a little bit, keeping in mind that we're seeing the heaviest rain and the highest overall winds through tonight and for the first half of tomorrow. Tomorrow afternoon, we transition away from the steady wind and the steady rain over to a severe thunderstorm threat and could have that isolated tornado possibility for tomorrow afternoon and evening. Sunday, I told you we get to that. Not a great day as the center of circulation is close to us, but it's that storm should lose a lot of its energy by that point. So I still think we're going to have a few problems, but not nearly as much of an issue on Sunday. And guys, it looks like uh, into next week we'll finally get a little bit of a break after a very rough weekend. Can't wait for that, Rich. And now we have a few nominees for Player of the Week. How about Bree Moffitt from Smyrna Field Hockey? She had four goals in their 9-0 win over Caesar Rodney. And Darnell Stokes is my nominee with not one, but two pick sixes and Indian Rivers win over Polytech today. Not bad at all. And finally, one more thing. It's a big week in the office because Devin and I are <laughs> facing off in that 47 ABC Fantasy Football League. Here's the teams right here. Mine's on the left. Devin's on the right. Of course, right now, Devin is projected to win by about 10 points. Let's go, boys. He's also 2-0. <laughs> Let's go, boys. I need the W. I need Josh Allen to give me some, uh, some more points, though. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, Puka Nakua plays. All right, that's going to do it for us. See you later.